Welcome back to Design Thinking and Innovation, uh, week 12. Uh, we are moving on to the project section. Uh, we looked at the process. We actually had a look at the tools. Now we have to make use of these tools in the project that you are trying to do. Okay, so let us go ahead. It is uh, section P12, uh, week 12. So, you need to apply all this minimum viable product, proof of concept, information architecture, experience design in the project that you are trying to do. Okay, so, if you look at the content uh, MVP, POC, IA and XD. Why is this part important? Okay, prototype part 2 takes you further closer to the final design. Okay, so, it makes it, it, makes it uh, much more visible, makes it tangible. Uh, because of this, you can test and get feedback and then change if it is necessary. Okay, so, we have seen that it involves all these things, MVP, POC, information architecture as well as experience design. Okay, so, you have to make use of all of them. So, you are moving from a soft prototype to a medium prototype and you are also becoming much better at what you are trying to do. It means that, uh, you know, you make use of MVP, minimum viable product, uh, POC, proof of concept, uh, IA, information architecture, XT, experience design, all of these things uh, while you are doing your prototype. So, uh, think a bit. Okay, try all this out because they are beautiful concepts. Okay, they actually make your product much better than what it was. So, this is uh, at the stage of medium prototype. Okay, so, in terms of steps, note down the final concept chosen, apply these techniques, make use of viable product or proof of concept and get feedback. Uh, you can do the information architecture to organize the information if it is very communication based solution. Uh, make use of experience design that means all the different sensories how they can actually make this uh, you know interacting with the product uh, much more memorable as an interaction. So, again thanks a lot for listening. Uh, this is section P12, uh, week 12. Uh, just summarizing. Uh, we have done the process, we finished the tools, uh, now we have applied it in the project. Uh, so, again going back, uh, minimum viable product, proof of concept, information architecture and experience design and then we will see a very nice, you know, project, a case study of uh, storage design to reduce post harvest loss of vegetables, how you can actually preserve these vegetables. Okay, so, that is the case study. Thank you.